If you ain't talking money, I don't wanna talk. I'll call you back. You can tell I got this sack just by the way I walk. The name's Travis Bucks of Plenty of the Bucks of Plenty Fortune. I was class up in the sky, pop a champagne. Hola, soy José Carizo Espinosa. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Hi there, my name is Timothy Keller, and welcome to Reason for God. Uh, today we're going to be discussing whether it's wrong to be rich or not. Uh, what are your opinions? Well, Tim, Father says that all the good people will have money. And, uh, trust me, we do. There's a reason why some people don't have money. But Father says that the good will get the money and the bad will not, and the good go to heaven. So, I believe it is not a bad thing to be rich. In fact, it's a very, very good thing. Are you saying that the bad people, or, or the poor people, will go to hell? Yes. Yes. Ay, Dios santo mío. Gringos. That's an interesting response. Uh, does anyone want to retort that? Yes, Mr. Espinosa? You cannot say this. Porque I read in the Bible every day. And he says in Matthew 6.24, You cannot serve God and money. Porque this, you cannot have money. You need to serve God with the hard work on your back. That is what I believe. You know what I'm saying? I agree with that Mexican dude from Mexico. You know what I'm saying? But them other dudes who got money going down the timeline, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't agree with that. I came from the bottom and I made mine mine. No one can take that away from me. Okay, very interesting, Mr. Espinosa. Uh, would anyone else like to chime in? Anyone? Yeah, me, you know what I'm saying? I came from the bottom, you know what I'm saying? So I don't think being rich means that you're going to be bad. It only means that you could do better. I'm going to do better with me and mine and spending my money how I want to. I understand old dude, Josue from Mexico, but you got dudes like White Boy right here, and he got a whole mansion and a whole all kinds of boats and yachts and stuff. And then this dude over here got a kingdom, <laughs> got gold all over the house and stuff. You know what I'm saying? It may be rich, bad to be rich, but if you do good with it, that's what's up. Seriously? Wow. These people clearly don't know what they're talking about because having money is nothing but good. It's brought nothing but good into my life. The Rolex, the Bentley. I mean, why would my life be bad? Can you imagine why I could, I could not be a bad person? So they don't know what they're talking about at all, which is what Father says. I do not agree with this filth because in the Bible, Luke 18, 25, it says it is easier for a camel to enter the eye of a needle than it is for a rich man to enter the kingdom of heaven. Oh, wow. And when you think about that, you realize that even though man is sinful at nature, if he tries hard in his life, it is possible for him to enter the kingdom of heaven no matter the wealth that he obtains in his lifetime. Very interesting point. Uh, I think that concludes our discussion. Thank you, senors. Thank you, senor. Ooh, come again. Thanks, blood. Good job, man. Your Highness, thank you for coming. Thank you, sir. Thank you for coming. Yes. We had a good discussion here today on Reason for God. Please join us again. Thank you.